Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, um, I thought I'd give you guys a lunchtime reading, right? It's your lunch break, kick your feet up, just enjoy the messages, you know? Anyway, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, and thank you so much everyone for all of your support. Thank you. Um, thank you to all of my subscribers. I love you. Thank you for joining this awesome soul family. And uh, welcome to everybody new here. If you're new here, with this deck, I can maybe tell you what you're having for lunch today and call out your signs when I see them, okay? And don't forget, you guys, at the end of the reading, we're going to crack open your fortune cookie and read your fortune, okay? <laughs> anyway, Spirit, what messages do you have for my beautiful collective? Messages for my collective, please. Straight shooter. All of a sudden, I feel... I feel like I need to get really quiet. I don't know what that's where that's coming from. Um, so maybe somebody is feeling kind of shy around you, maybe even timid, afraid to come forward and talk to you because they need to tell you the truth about why they used you before in the past. Okay, I feel like this person... Uh, there's a person that treated you miserably. They treated you like an option. They left you behind feeling very used. Um, they know they need to confront this. They know they need to tell you the truth and give you an apology. I just feel like they're shrinking down. Okay, that's what the feeling that I'm getting is like they're shrinking down, um, kind of curling up into a little ball, tucking their tail between their legs. <laughs> They're afraid to face you after what they've done. Okay. Um, yeah. You could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Yeah, see? And I feel like this person was a player. They need to tell you the truth, not just about what they did to you, but what they've been doing, too, maybe in separation. This person's, they were a major player. But it's you that they feel guilty about. Like, you're the only one. Um, this connection has really stuck with them. I feel like in the past, they didn't care who they hurt. They didn't care what they did. You know, you got with a player, and they saw you kind of like everybody else at first, but not anymore. Um, there's something about you, something about this connection. They can't just do what they did to you and forget all about it like the others. They, there's something about your energy that's, um, it's kind of eating them up inside what they did to you, okay? They can't seem to stop thinking about it. And for this player, it's very unusual. Like they, um, they've always been able to, to come in, rush into people's lives, use them, put them in third parties and leave quickly and not give it a second thought. But you, you're different. You're different from all the others. This is really affecting them what they've done. And they cannot seem to stop thinking about it. I kind of get the sense too that their wand isn't working anymore. They're only just thoughts about you. That's the only thing that turns them on. No one else does anymore. Like this person can't even be a player anymore because their wand's not working. Not when they not when they're with anyone else. It's just with you. This person only wants you now. And I feel like when they played you, they left you behind very quickly, like ghosted you. And you haven't had anything to do with this person. Like, your your energy really isn't even out here. You could be dealing with the Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, heavy Sagittarius. They're only, they only have passionate thoughts about you. You're the only one. They can't physically be with anybody else right now because... No one else turns them on the way you do. They're, um, I feel like this person is crying in their beer over you, okay? They're spending a lot of time maybe at a bar, possibly doing a lot of drinking, thinking about this. Like, why do you have this effect on them? Why can't they use this wand anymore, okay? Why are they only passionate when they think about you? This person knows, too, with the Page of Cups here, 
they know they need to apologize. That's their central focus. And it's like, they're, uh, you know, I'm picturing a, a man sitting at a bar, just looking into his beer, kind of shaking his head back and forth slowly, like, why can't I get the collective out of my mind? That's pretty much what this person is thinking about. Um, what's happening to me? Like, that's what they're, that's what they're thinking. I feel like this person feels sorry for themselves. They, they, they are very confused. Um, yeah, because this is someone, this is someone usually who has no problem sleeping around with other people, but they're, um, they, they can, their wand isn't working. Okay. Their wand is not working. It's, it's frustrating to this person because they're usually very strong, very virile. You know what I mean? Healthy, everything's working right, you know? And, um, yeah, they're not passionate about anybody else. That's why. I feel like this is a player in love and they don't want to admit it to themselves. Like they're, they're still kind of in denial. Okay about their feelings they don't want to admit that they're actually in love with you and they are you know so all they do really is sit and drink over you um they do yeah they're in love with you this is the ace of cups they don't want to admit that they love you this much they don't want to admit that you've done something to this person okay you have done something to this person, and now they're in a lot of regret. Um, yeah, they're wishing they would have never turned their back on you. No one else compares to you. Um, they're never going to find another you. So they want to come back. They want to come back around. This person spends long hours sitting at a bar, drinking, staring into their drink and looking or and thinking about you, okay? I don't know why I said looking. Maybe this person kind of looks around for you everywhere, hoping to bump into you again, hoping to see your face, hoping for another um like a communication, a talk. I feel like this person's in a whole lot of regret. They know they need to tell you the truth. Okay? I kind of get the sense, too, that they it's almost like they're a sloppy mess. Okay? Maybe they're drinking too much. Maybe they're doing some crying here because they are very emotional. It's almost like a what have I done kind of feeling. Okay? Because they want to come back in, but I feel like this whatever they did to you, it, it's pretty much wrecked their chances with you, okay? Um, and it's taken this person too long to come back around. You could be dealing with a uh, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, Leo Aries Sagittarius, heavy Sagittarius energy here. They're wondering if you've met somebody new, do you have other options? Okay, this person's worried. It has been way too long since they've communicated with you. Yeah, I feel like that's what they're worried about is if you've started something new with someone else. That's what they're worried about. You could be a Leo Aries Sagittarius. Yeah, you could be a Cancer. High Priestess energy here coming off of you. So, um, yeah, maybe you even mentioned something to this person before um, that they would regret leaving you behind or something like that. And you were right about it. I feel like you're extremely intuitive. You're silent as well. So you're not speaking to this person 
um, you haven't spoken to them. There has been no communication. And I feel like you, you could very well be starting something new with someone else here. With the Queen of Wands energy, yeah. If someone, either you've already started something with someone new or they or it's happening in the future or this person thinks that you will okay you're definitely not giving them any of your attention anymore because honestly they haven't spoken to you and you don't trust this person this is the page of pentacles this is meeting somebody new you could be having a salad for lunch today you could be eating chicken strips for lunch today But this is you meeting somebody new here, and they are in a lot of regret. See, when they think about that, they cry. I feel like you've got somebody new coming in. You do. Either you've already met them or you're about to meet them, okay? But yeah, you have somebody new coming. Definitely. You may even, you may even be um, getting to know a couple of people. There could be more than one person approaching, approaching you here to court you, to date you. Yeah, you're getting a new beginning here. Yep, you're getting a new counterpart. And this person, I feel like they're stressed out about this. They're a mess over this, okay? Or they're thinking they've created a mess. This is a huge mess. How are they gonna, how are they gonna get you back? How are they gonna clean up their mess? How are they gonna tell you all of this, okay? You don't trust this person anymore and they left you alone to start a new life. So yeah, this person is a big mess over this. I'm telling you, they're doing a lot of crying. Um, they're sitting at a bar a lot, just staring into their beer. I don't know. But you have grown cold to this person. You don't feel about them the same way you did before because you recognize them now as a player. And all the trust is gone. They didn't respect you. They didn't consider you. They thought they could just play you and walk away from this. And this person cannot let you go. They cannot let you go, but you're moving on. Cancer, heavy cancer energy in this reading, you guys. Yeah, this is where you split. That door is shut. This person's out of time to make things right. Yeah, it's over. A deal breaker. Oof. Whew. And I feel like once you start meeting this new person here, you're not going to be looking back to the past. You're releasing the past here and moving forward. You could be eating like guacamole dip today, maybe uh, maybe some cornbread. You could be a Taurus Aries. Heavy water sign energy. But yeah, you're going in a different direction. Uh, you've gotten, it's like you've released all of the baggage, all of the burdens from this connection, and you're ready to move forward to new love. There's someone new coming into your life that's making you feel excited, enthusiastic, okay? This person could be finding out about that. You could be posting something on your social media about it. Yeah, this is just a mess, right? That's what this person is thinking. This is just a huge mess. This is such a mess. How did I, why did I play the collective? Why? How can I possibly be in love, right? Everything is a mess to this person right now. They are all messed up in the head over this, okay? And you're out here in this beautiful um earth angel light worker energy with the star you could be an aquarius attracting the attention of a lot of other people they can't stand the thought of that but they're they still don't want to admit it to themselves that they're in love with you okay 
Like, it's kind of freaking out this player that they actually, they fooled around and fell in love. That's the song I'm hearing. Fooled around and fell in love, right? Yes. Um, I don't remember who sings that song, but... They're, uh, they are a mess over you, collective. And they're about to lose you for good. Okay, because you've got new love coming in and the door is shutting on this person. Like, this is the end to a cycle here. Oh, I'm going to keep this one out. I want, yeah, and that's the truth. That's the truth. You are about to get new love. Ooh, collective. You are about to get new love, and this new love is coming in fast. I always see this as a racetrack. So, yeah, you're going to be getting a new soulmate connection. All right. Oh, gosh, I almost caught that one, though. And this person is feeling the pressure from the universe right now. They are pressed. Because they're never going to find another person who, like, you completely light this person's fire and they don't even understand like they don't get it you know uh, they have played so many other people and walked away from them like it's nothing but they cannot walk away from you i mean they they walked away physically but this person can't get over you okay and this player like they don't want to admit that they have fallen in love that this is love Oh, just wait. This person, it's going to hit the fan when they find out you've got this new cookie. I'm telling you, this is definitely someone new. Someone new coming in. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, they're feeling this pressure now because now this person, they feel like it's a race against time, even though time's up for them. Um, they've got to get to you before you get new love. Okay, they're, they're going to have to compete. They're going to have to compete for your love. They're going to have to fight for this. They're going to have to be honest with you. They're going to have to prove themselves. But you are getting new love. This is just a this is a major confirmation of that. New love is coming in for you and it's coming in fast, okay? So get ready for that. All right, so let's crack open your fortune cookie. Okay, you will have a close encounter of a surprising kind, and that's what this is. I feel like that's what this is. New love coming in for you, okay? Um, I feel like it's just going to confirm this reading, too, and that alone is going to surprise you. Um, but, yeah, it's coming in fast. I would say, um, I would say even within a couple of weeks. Let's see. One, two maybe four weeks from now in the next month within the next month okay maybe even still this month and your lucky numbers for today are 8 11 25 26 28 and 47 okay um number one this ends with an 11 here so that's a divine number this person from your past, they want to come back around too. Um, yeah. You're going to have, you could possibly have up to three people that want to come towards you. Okay? Three people, but only one. You're only going to choose the one here, this new cookie. Anyway, if you, if you add all these numbers together and break them down numero numerology style, you're going to end up with one number. Okay? You can Google the meaning of that number, and it will give you some insights as to maybe um, what to expect in the future or what you need to work on and whatever you need to know, okay? So you may want to check out that lucky number. Anyway, this is what I have for this reading. I do hope this helps. If you like this video, please hit that like button. Yay! Subscribe to my channel, you guys. Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.